Huck Hyder. The villainous bad Borg whistled on the TV screens in the early 1970s with toys Keek Hyder, where he was a badass pain in the ass to the show's lead hero. He later returned in Keek Hyder Zero One, had a solo effort in 1995's Mechanical Violator Huck Hyder, appeared in the Keek Hyder anime, and was probably introduced to a great number of you through his recent appearance in Kamen Rider Gaim, as well as the Hakaider reboot movie. Anytime I can get my greedy cheapy fingers on cheapy Hakaider goodies is a swell day indeed. This time 30 bucks has scored a Metacom Real Action Heroes Hakaider. Every Real Action Heroes figure has the same superbly articulated Ken-like plastic proportions with appropriate fabric garments and costumes to fit over it. Like a uh, figure arts, but with doll clothes. Whatever you want to label this uh, action doll, holy jumping just beyond does the RAH aesthetic work here. By having a real cloth costume with organic folds as opposed to molded plastic, it just totally achieves the genuine 1970s look of this tokusatsu anti-hero. Accessory-wise, the 8-inch Hakaider comes with two different pairs of soft plastic gloves, which just interchange with stupidies, and a gun hand to aim his signature Hakaider shot, which can also be snugly holstered into his boot. Prepare to pose, as you can get this guy in a range of dynamic stances and looks. My one issue is that for whatever reason it seems his left elbow doesn't like to bend as much as it should. I'm left to guess this is probably a result of owning a previously owned toy, where this joint just might not be so tight anymore, or if somehow the fabric is actually preventing it from properly going into place. But as I always seem to say when I cover these things, who cares, big whoop, life goes on, and I keep on loving the circuitry out of this thing by uttering COOL every 12 parsecs. Definitely stoked to have this piece in my collection, and certainly much happier to dish out $30 as opposed to the near $100 they're asking for the recently released SH Figure Arts version of this guy. So, if this is your first time encountering Kikaider's nemesis, my biggest Hakaider recommendation for you all is Kita Amamiya's Mechanical Violator Hakaider. It is, without a doubt, an entertaining, inane, violent, and aesthetically amazing 55-minute experience. You shouldn't have any trouble finding it on eBay for about 10 bucks, maybe even less. Anyhow, I gotta go back to adoring this badass android. So, for Hakaider's sake, keep watching more Tokusatsu for the good of robot kind and yourselves, and please collect responsibly. Fare thee well for the memento. <laughs>